Science. A team from the University of Surrey have developed a new and more reliable way of detecting cancer by testing a small urine sample from men. The scientists working at this laboratory in Guildford, 45 kilometres from London, have helped identify a protein called EN2, which is only produced by prostate cancer cells and secreted in urine. The early results are very encouraging. There are other screens used by the NHS. So, for example, the presence of um, blood in, in stool is used to screen for bowel cancer. And I think the results we're getting from EN2 are um, certainly a, as good as that type of screening test. Prostate cancer is the third highest cause of mortality in men in Europe, affecting 300,000 of them. Early treatment is absolutely the key to, to prostate cancer um, development. You know, if you get it, catch it early, you've got a better than 80% chance of a cure. If you catch it late, then that drops down to 20%. At this workshop in Florida, the participants are learning about how to tackle Alzheimer's. Even though it's in America, the whole class takes place in Spanish for the benefit of the target group, who are older members of the Hispanic community. It's important they learn as much as possible, as scientists have discovered this community is one and a half times more likely to suffer from the disease. The high prevalence is mainly because of longer life expectancy, plus an increased tendency to suffer from diabetes and hypertension. My own feeling is that awareness of Alzheimer's disease is actually low across the board. Uh, that while awareness may be lower in the Latin or Hispanic communities, it is increasing, it is picking up. The number of older Hispanics with Alzheimer's and related dementias could rise more than sixfold, from fewer than 200,000 cases today to as many as 1.3 million in 2050.